okay, supplement part G, which is the accept and rejection step in step five of the cigarette algorithm. So what we need to do is, so we need to um, sample X and Y uniformly on the set A, G, B, uh, where X and Y satisfies these two conditions. X is between 0 and R, R excluded, and our Y is between 0 and G, B of X both boundaries included. So it's just the area under the graph of GB. And the exception rejection procedure is we accept the first coordinate if the second coordinate well, satisfies Y less or equal than F of X and otherwise we reject. And let's look at the step three in, in more detail. So, um, step three, was i equal to m? Well, nothing to do. That was a trivial step. So, we were in the, um, we choose a rectangle which corresponds to the, the, uh, the tail part, and there we don't need to check. So, now, the bit more interesting case, so step 3 with i less than n. So if x is less than xi minus 1, well, there was nothing to do. Um, we just could accept x since y is less than f of x by construction. case we really need to check whether whether we are below f of x or not so there we really need to check y less or equal than f of x and for this we have to simulate the second component and we are in the rectangle i so X, Y is a realization of the uniform distribution on I. So we can write Y as F of X, I plus F of X, I minus one minus F of X, I times W2. This W2 is the sample of a uniformly distributed variable on 0, 1, independent of X. And this means test we need to perform is f of x i plus f of x i minus 1 minus f of x i w2 less or equal than f of x. Um, this explains the testing condition um, for the non-trivial part in a bit more detail.